the same bold fox I saw before. I've been wounded. That'll teach you. With his leg permanently maimed by gunshot, fox cub bold knew he would never be able to hunt again. Bold decided that since humans had crippled him, they should feed him. So he and Crow moved into town. Start foraging. There's some rich pickings. Pickings which you'll share with me. Oh. Of course. You've earned it. Hope you'd say that. Here's your share of mine. Mm. Things are looking up. But not for the wounded adder holed up in White Deer Park. Still there, Scarface. Still here, Ada. You're wasting your time. Soon you'll be wasting away. Laughing when I've just bitten your tail off. Only a farthing Ada would do that. Come on. Admit it. You're the famous farthing adder. You're the brave snake who killed Scarface's son. Admit it. I'll get you. See if I don't. Not if I get you first. Have you anything to say before the court passes sentence on you? I confess, Weasel gave Ada the wrong message. It's her fault. Creep! Creep yourself. You can't confess for somebody else, you know, Measley. It isn't allowed. I'm sure we told Ada to kill Starface. We did, didn't we, Measley? How do I know? <laughs> See, my lady, I always let her do all the talking. That I can believe. Objection, me lad, matey. How dare you? Oh, yes. Carry on. If Weasel told Adder to kill Scarface, she would have, matey, but she didn't. She killed the wrong fox. Case proven, me lad, I mean, lady, those weasels are guilty. Oh, that's not fair. What about the chief witness? And who, pray, might that be? Adder. If it's their word against hers, matey, I'd believe Adder. But we haven't heard Adder's word yet. Where is the chief witness? Who knows? Weasel, you are merely playing for time. And as I want to go hunting... In the absence of further evidence, the judge will pronounce sentence. For dropping Adder in it, the sentence of this court is that you both be taken to a wet place and... Dropped in it.
Friendly, you should be on watch. Charmer will be waiting for you. Charmer? Oh, yes, she was waiting for someone, all right. But it wasn't me. What do you mean? I caught her with Ranger, Scarface's son. They were acting very friendly. What? Disgraceful! <sighs> I had a feeling this might happen. Traitorous cub. What has she told you? Nothing. And she's no traitor. Or at least she doesn't mean to be. What does it matter what she means to be? A traitor is a traitor! She's in love. Don't you remember how it was, Fox? Well... It was different with us. We're both red foxes. This ranger... Ranger is blue. You wouldn't tell him. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Shut up! So, we were not to know about this ranger of yours, hmm? I would have told you myself when the time was right. The time could never be right. You and he could never make a match. How can you say that? You haven't even met him. I don't need to. You're red. He's blue. What more do you want? We're young. What difference does our colour make? If I may intercede, Fox, love, as we all know, is reputed to be blind. Never mind all that claptrap. His father and I are at war. Perhaps your children will bring peace to the two tribes. Please don't drive another of my cubs away, Fox. Oh. So now we're back to bold, are we? I'm sorry. I only meant don't be too hard on Charmer. You could at least meet her young admirer. You're all against me. No, no. So you think I should meet this? Ranger. Yes, I do. All right. Better fetch him. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, I wish Badger was here. The young just don't seem to value the oath as we did. Badger? Badger? Are you all right? Badger? Uh, Moly. Ah, old friend. I'm not Moly. I'm... Hmm? Time to get up, is it? Time to go out in the moonlight to hunt in Farthing Wood. Farthing Wood? Badger, you're dreaming. We're in White Deer Park. <sighs> the moonlight playing through the leaves of the trees. Light and shade, so you hardly even see the black and white coats of my ancestors. Badger? Badger? <laughs> Badger, it's, it's your old friend, Mole. Mole? I don't know any moles, only badgers. My brothers and sisters, tired after a night's playing, settling down to sleep. No, don't go to sleep, badger. Not yet. Oh, not yet. <laughs> about us and... I may have done something really terrible. Do you have an adder in your company? Yes, why? Did she kill Bounder? Yes, I... I'm sorry, Ranger. It was meant to be your father. So, it was no accident. My father was right. Bounder's death was part of a plot against us. Well then, I'm glad I told him. What? What did you tell him? I told him where to find your precious snake. You told Scarface? Oh, no, but, but Adder saved my mother's life. He mustn't hurt her. She would have killed my father. 
ranger. Charmer's not happy. A lover's tiff? Poor Charmer. Poor nothing. It's the best news I've heard all day. Fox, is that you? Yes, Mossy. What's wrong? It's Badger. I think he's dying. Badger, old friend. Badger? Ah, Fox. Come to persuade me to leave Farthingwood, have you? No. No, I'm sorry. I could never leave my old home. My birth place. Badger, I'm sorry I was unkind to you. A fox? Worried about kindness? <laughs> I must be in heaven. <laughs> Badger. He's gone. <laughs> he really has gone. <laughs> in the midst of life, we are in death. Ow, shut up! Ah, oh, no! Oh, where shall we go now? Ah, I appeal to you! Oh, no, you don't. I don't know. I'm getting proper crusty in my old age, aren't I? You're not old. Not yet. All the same, we must all learn from that wise old badger how to grow old gracefully. Yeah, an example to all of us. I'll miss him. At least I don't have to pretend to be my father anymore. <laughs> Meanwhile, far from his father's guidance, young Bold was beginning to find his way around town. I left a piece of meat for you as well. Oh, why don't you eat it? I'm not hungry. Not hungry? Must be something wrong with you. So, what's wrong? It's just... I miss... other foxes. Oh, is that all? Plenty of foxes around? You'll soon bump into one of them? I already have. She wasn't interested. Now we have it. A she! A she! Well, a course of true love never did run smooth, my friend. Can't you jump over it? No. I was wounded in my back leg. You poor thing. Well, anyway, you're not missing much in here. I was going myself. What did you 
nothing was in that garden. Nothing now. I see. You're new around here, aren't you? Yes. Hunting's difficult, so I came to the town to forage. I suppose if you can't jump, you won't be able to run either. Of course I can't. My, we are touchy, aren't we? You'd be touchy all right if you'd been shot in the leg. I could be your legs, if you'd like. I'm not helpless. Oh dear. Sorry. No, don't go. It's it, it just... You could help me if you like. We could work as a team. make a good team but why three you must be very hungry well it's not for me it's for my friend friend a crow we have an arrangement we feed one another I never heard anything so silly in all my life oh never mind come on back to my earth I can't why not could be much more comfortable for you warmer too no, it's my friend. He'll be waiting for me. The crow! Oh, I see. Well, have it your own way. Oh! Oh! Fresh rat! How did you manage? I wasn't on my own. The vixen I told you about. Aww. Aww. Well, she and I hunted together. Oh, she's beautiful, Crow. Light as a whisper. She wanted me to go back with her to her earth. Why didn't you? You and I have an arrangement. Right and proper. Right and proper. Very nice. Thank you. Oh, very nice. In fact, um, so nice, I won't be needing any more. You can go with your vixen if you like, and no need to feed me. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Don't thank me. Thank your... Lucky stars, I know. <laughs> if you need me, just leave a bit of something under the bush. Then I'll know. Yes, a and you do the same. I'll miss you, Crow. Oh, you'll be far too busy for that. I wondered if you'd come. The Crow freed me from our agreement. So you'll be able to come back with me to my Earth? Yes. If you'll have me. Of course. Shall we hunt first? Oh, yes, please. I'm starving. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. How are we going to get you over that? Don't worry, I can still dig. It would take ages, and it's morning already. Let me look first. Bold, come here. Quick! The humans are waking up. There's no time to lose. Eat him quickly. Hurry! 
Hurry! Hurry! This way. All right. Yes. Thank you. It's lovely and warm in here. Mm. Oh, this is the life. You must be very tired. But happy. Mm. Life can be very hard. Especially for an old fox like you. Old? Me? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend you. You really think I'm old? But I'm still just a young buck. I'm sorry, it's just... You look... Whatever happened to you? I... travelled a long way. Where from? A nature reserve called White Deer Park. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have turned away like that. And I was selfish. You were bound to be upset about your father. What hope is there for us? There must be some. My father has agreed to meet you. What? If you'll meet him. So you're Scarface's famous son. Not as famous as you, sir. Flattery will get you nowhere. Sorry, I didn't mean... Your own father is famous too. Scarface. I think you honour your father. Yes, sir. Suppose your father attacked Charmer. Whose side would you fight on? That isn't fair. That is hard, Fox. It's what he has to face. Sir, I've thought about this a good deal. If it came to an all-out scrap between your family and mine, I wouldn't fight against you, but I wouldn't fight for you either. Well, at least he's honest. I suppose we've got to make do with that. Oh, thank you, Father. You haven't got my blessing, not yet. Thank you, sir. I'll keep my side of the bargain. You can be sure of that. It may come to that. Bargain? What bargain? I haven't made a bargain with him. Others credit me with more than I deserve. Oh, no. The famous fox from Farthing Wood. <laughs> but your father's a hero. Don't believe all they tell you. I'm really honoured to know you, Bold. <laughs>